The problem with most people is that they don't believe something can happen until it already has. It's not stupidity or weakness. It's just human nature. How did you know? Gerald Lane wrote a self-defeating Jeremiah about his employer, the UN, back in 2010. Caused a few ripples, sidelined your career. Thought you'd have parlayed those ripples into a self-righteous book. No one knows for profit. How did Israel know? We intercepted a communique from an Indian general saying they were fighting the Rakshasha. Translation, zombies. Technically, undead. Jurgen Warmbrom, high-ranking official in the Mossad, described as sober, efficient, not terribly imaginative. And yet, you build a wall because you read a communique that mentions the word zombie? Well, if you put it like that, I'd be skeptical as well. In the 30s, Jews refused to believe they could be sent to concentration camps. In 72, we refused to fathom we'd be massacred in the Olympics. In the month before October 1973, we saw Arab troop movements and we unanimously agreed they didn't pose a threat. Well, a month later, the Arab attack almost drove us into the sea. So we decided to make a change. Change? The 10th man. If nine of us look at the same information and arrive at the exact same conclusion, it's the duty of the 10th man to disagree. No matter how improbable it may seem, the 10th man has to start digging with the assumption that the other nine are wrong. And you were that 10th man? Precisely. <laughs> <laughs>